So who's up for a few hours of typing out variations on the same SQL queries? Anyone? Uh, anyone? You've just gotten access to a hot new database and you can't wait to explore the contents. Let's have a closer look at this recipes table here. We'll start by writing a top 10 query to check out what's inside. Oh, this cuisine type field looks interesting. Let's see how frequent each category in this field is. So first we'll pop in the cuisine type column name, then we'll add a count function, then of course we enter the table name, then we add a group by, oh, and then order it all by cuisine type. Hmm, this already feels like a lot of typing. Let's keep exploring. The ingredients table has a category field that we might also want to have a peek at. So let's copy and paste the previous query and we replace the cuisine type field with category here and here and here and here. Then we replace the table name. And finally, we can run this query and check out the data. So much typing. Luckily, the IDE has a bunch of functionality that lets us cut out a lot of this manual work. Let's start with a trick that helps us avoid using the star wildcard. We simply hit Alt or Option Enter next to this wildcard and the IDE will expand the column list for us. And we can now just go ahead and delete any of the fields that we don't want to retrieve. And if we do need to type out columns, or anything really, the IDE's sophisticated code completion makes this a breeze. Now this is really saving some time. What about join statements? Well, if we have the table foreign keys properly set up, or the join columns have the same name, the IDE will do the work for us, detecting the correct columns and automatically creating the table aliases. After this, we can select the qualify identifier context action by using our trusty alt or option enter shortcut and save the boilerplate of typing out each table alias. But what about when queries get really complex? Remember all of that boring copying and pasting that we had to do earlier? We can get rid of all of that using live templates, which are templates of frequently used queries. Let's say we want to template a query to get descriptive statistics. We can enter the query here and replace the column name and the table name with variables. We can then call this template in our console with the abbreviation of our choice. We can now easily use this template to get descriptive stats for any field in any table. With the IDE, cut out all of that boring stuff and crank out those queries.